Hey Diva, so in today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you guys a demo and a review of this new Laura Mercier foundation. So if you guys are interested, then definitely keep on watching. Okay Diva, so let's just jump right in. I'm super excited to see how this foundation performs. So before we jump in, I am going to, um, I've already done my eyebrows, then I'm going to prime my face. So I'm going to be using the Vitamin Enrich Face Base by Bobbi Brown. I recently purchased this and I fell in love. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna be using this today. So now that we are all prepped and primed, we're gonna get right into the foundation, but I wanted to tell you guys a little bit about the foundation before we just jumped in and put it on so we could talk about the claims and everything and kind of compare it to what I'm experiencing today because this is my first time trying out this foundation. We have the Laura Mercier Real Flawless Weightless Perfecting Foundation, and today I have it in the color 6-in-1 Clove. Now, I got this color because in the other foundation, I believe on 6-in-1, let me check. So yeah, this foundation I love, and that's why I wanted to try this one. This is the Flawless Lumiere Radiance Perfecting Foundation. Um, and yeah, I am, this is six in one truffle, but this one is called Clove. So I don't know, like color wise, I was just hoping that they kind of correlated, but yeah. Anywho, that is why I picked up this color. Um, so let's go ahead and take it out. Okay, so this is what the packaging is giving. It's giving very luxurious. I love like the um, frosted glass. Looks really nice, I like it. So I got it from Sephora and I'm gonna go ahead and read the claims from there or like basically what it is, like the description directly from there. And of course, everything that I show you guys will be linked down in the description box below. So if you are interested in anything at any point, definitely check that out. So anyways, let's get right into the foundation. So it says what it is is a weightless foundation that blurs the line between makeup and skin with medium buildable coverage waterproof wear and up to 12 hours of fade proof wear that's big claims it says the coverage is medium the finish is natural and the formulation is liquid all right so now that we know about the foundation let's just go ahead dive in and put it on um i am gonna go ahead and apply it to one side of my face and then i'll come back and kind of you know inject like what i'm feeling about it so far Okay, you guys, so I have the foundation on one side of my face, and as you guys can see, it's definitely giving off like a very natural radiant type of feel. I can definitely see it being medium coverage. It is showing some of my imperfections here. I don't know if you guys can see them, but yeah, it's not like very, very obvious, but I can still see my imperfections a little bit. Um, but I feel like it does not, I'm not mad at it. Like it looks really, really good. It looks really natural and it definitely feels very lightweight on the skin. And yeah, overall, I'm really liking how it looks. Okay, Diva, so now we have the foundation all over our face. So one thing I will say is that this does put a little bit darker on me, um, even darker than the other shade, but I'm not really mad at that because once I add my concealer and everything, it looks good and I always rather, for myself personally, have a foundation that's a little bit darker because i don't know like i feel like i could work with it more rather than it being lighter so with this foundation so far i am loving the finish that it gives off um as you guys can see a very natural and radiant feel it looks more like um skin after you have done like your skincare routine looks like my skin but better to me so yeah i'm really feeling it and i love i think more than anything i love the fact that i cannot feel this on my face like i feel like i have nothing on and that is just like so surprising so yeah i really really do love it so far okay you so i am all done with my makeup let's talk about the foundation so as far as this foundation i really love it first of all the packaging is top tier okay it's very elegant very nice i love the frosted glass and just like the white it just looks very chic so i don't know packaging is important to me i feel like if the packaging looks good the product is probably gonna be good so anyway let's just go ahead and talk about it so as far as the color match goes it was a little bit darker but as you guys can see like now that i've applied the rest of my face 
base it kind of just like goes and I really really do like that um the other foundation that I have by them is I guess kind of in the same color one of the names is different at the end but it's basically the same color um the other one is not as dark for me but they both work really well for me as you guys can see like it really matches well so I am not mad about that but if you are my skin tone and you want to get this one um it will appear a little bit darker but as you can see like once you put on the rest of your face it you know it makes sense so as far as the blendability of the foundation in um blendability is that a word but anyways as far as the way it blends i really love the way it blends with a beauty blender now typically i am a bl a brush girl excuse me i was about to say blush i'm a blush girl too <laughs> But yeah, typically I am a blush, a brush girl, and I really love the way it blends with the beauty blender. I feel like it gives it, like it, it helps more with the natural radiance rather than me having to put it on with a brush because I feel like I would, I don't know, when I apply something with a brush, I just feel like it should have more coverage. So yeah, and then you could definitely get more coverage if you apply it with a brush, but for me, I was just going for something that is more of a like i want a full beat but i want it to be like more on the natural side if that makes any sense as far as like my skin and my base goes so as far as the coverage this is definitely a medium coverage you are not going to be getting a full coverage however the good thing about it is that it is not heavy so you can definitely build it up to what you want it to be in case um you may have like some dark marks that you want to cover up or conceal um or you can go in just with your concealer and i feel like it will play very well with it um i can't test that out for you guys if you want me to you can definitely just comment and let me know and I will do that but I feel like it definitely plays well um you know with like building it up I feel like it will be really nice because this I just have one pump on each side of my face and it looks really good already so and it's kind of covering up my imperfections um I do have on powder and everything I feel like it covers pretty good but it's not gonna cover it like to the max so just keep that in mind like you may need to build it up if you want like more and more coverage like if you want it to be like full on you know flawless definitely keep that in mind but yeah overall I really like the foundation I would definitely give it like hmm I would definitely give it like a 10 out of 10 okay because I just really love it I also love the other foundation that I showed you guys at the beginning by Laura Mercier so I was like I feel like this is like a more like natural type of um type of feel um if that makes any sense the other one is really really good but it does have a fuller coverage where this one is lighter and i just feel i don't know like i just really really like this one a lot i feel like this is more like reachable like you can wear this every day and not feel like wow like i have on a lot of makeup okay so i really really do like it i will highly recommend it um i do not know the retail price let me look that up so we can talk about that too because i need to start talking about the prices of the foundation so this foundation does retail for 48 dollars however i feel like it's worth it i feel like it's worth it okay um and I'll, I'll tell you why like i mean let me show you why okay like it just looks very very good on the skin so i feel like if you definitely could splurge on a foundation definitely do it because this foundation is really high quality i can already tell um i will be doing a wear test to kind of um be able to let you guys know like how i feel about it because this is definitely going to be i'm gonna have a foundation video coming up and i'm gonna talk about all the foundations that i've been trying and i've been loving and using um so yeah i'm gonna do a wear test and then i'm gonna do a follow-up um so make sure you guys stay tuned for that video but yeah this foundation i could tell like it's very high quality it's definitely going to last i already know but make sure y'all stay tuned you know for my upcoming review um, or my updated review but yeah i really like it if you can girl definitely go ahead and splurge on her because she's definitely worth it i just love how flawless my skin looks and just how light way everything feels like I hate feeling like I have on a lot of makeup because it just makes me want to go home and do my skincare routine and that is not that's not where it's at okay I want to feel just flawless and look good in my makeup and not even have to worry about it but yeah it was that it's pretty much it I do hope that you guys enjoyed this video and found it very helpful and easy to follow and if you did then make sure you go ahead and give me a thumbs up and before I close out the video if you guys are interested in anything definitely check the description box I will have everything linked that I did use so definitely go ahead and check that out but yeah 
thank you guys so so much for watching make sure you leave a comment in case you have any comments questions or concerns have you tried out this foundation are you thinking about trying it out um definitely let me know and be sure to go ahead and subscribe if you haven't done so already also hit that notification bell so you will not miss any of my upcoming videos but yeah thank you so so much for watching i greatly appreciate it and i'll see you guys in the next video bye